Mm -hmm. Hi guys, guess what? We're live. Hey. <laughs> Thank you, wake up. <laughs> Welcome in, everybody. We have Dawn here. Hi, Dawn. Hi. We appreciate you coming to Monday mornings with Dawn and Teresa. It should be this way because you're I'm turning my, my volume on my phone off. So I don't Dawn and Teresa. There you go. <laughs> Dawn and Teresa. Yeah. We and we have our wonderful guest, Becky, a new life resale. Becky today. And we're she's here have, with full of energy today. I know. I need right. six cup of coffee to keep up with her. <laughs> but it'll bring fun to the show. Welcome in. Who do we have here today? Ashley. We have Becky. And I can't see the chat. <laughs> it's Monday morning, guys. Hi, Pearl. We have three people in here. That's you, me, and uh, Ashley and Dawn. Dawn, Mary. I know people will come. Angela, welcome in. Angela, could you drop me an email or are you gray? I don't know if you're gray. I don't know if I have your information. Oh, yeah. I, I sent it to you. Never mind, Angela. It's Monday. <laughs> She's like, I'm here. <laughs> nice to see you. Thank you for coming in. How was your weekend, ladies? Dawn? It was a weekend. A weekend. Um, we're still trying to get things under and packed, and you know all that good stuff. I'm gonna I'm gonna pull up a picture to show you what I did this weekend. You're gonna laugh. All right, I'm gonna make hey, a tooch. Hey, tooch. Becky with the good oh, hair. She made you big before you look up. So, yeah, here it is. So if you <laughs> if you've hung around me for any period of time, you guys have probably heard me talk about this local theater group that I do. And our theater group was hired to be um, like cast for a gala fundraising event. The fundraising event was um, a trip to Alice in Wonderland, like as if they fell down the rabbit hole. And so my theater troupe was hired to dress up as Alice in Wonderland characters. Oh, so cool. so there I am. I'm the white rabbit with my big hips. <laughs> my big clock. And uh, it was at Longwood Gardens. I live right by Longwood Gardens. That's awesome. Such a beautiful venue. And we had so much fun. It was really cool. That's yeah. a cute I show you the rest of my, my castmates, but I don't know if they want their face on YouTube. Yeah. We had the... Um, <laughs> The March hair. We had the Mad Hatter with a really huge hat. Um, we had the Dormouse. D Tweedledee and Tweedledum were there. Um, the Cheshire Cat, the Caterpillar. It was cool. It was really fun. Cool. Hello, Kathy. Welcome in. Nice to see hey, you. Kathy. That sounds like a lot of fun. It does. It really was. We have so much fun together. So our group, we perform a... Um, a play in January and we do so much rehearsal between like October when it starts all the way through January. We, be, we are like family. We've all been doing it for many, many years together. And then we don't see each other. Like we're like, okay, the play is over. We'll see you next year. And so like, we get so close with each other and then we, you know, we see each other here and there, I guess, but this was really nice to get to connect with everyone. And Longwood Gardens is just stunning. And the food was, was lovely. The event was lovely. So it's good. Aww. Yeah, that I think the fun. fundraiser raised over seventy thousand wow. dollars in one wow. night. Congratulations! Or, um, That's yeah, awesome. Was it wasn't me. I was just, I was just the bunny. <laughs> That's but awesome. It was, yeah, it was cool to be part of it. She's like, I was just the bunny. I was, yeah, I was just the white rabbit. I bet you were the white rabbit with the most energy. <laughs> <laughs> well, it was funny because at one point the, the band, you know, like they play low music while everyone's eating. And then at one point the band really kicked it up and they were playing Michael Jackson. I was feeling it. You guys know me. I just, I can't sit still anyway. Plus, I'm, I'm sitting behind us. We had this long table that was like a tea party set up, like as if we were at the, you know, the mad tea party. And so I'm, I'm dancing and one of the Cheshire cat comes up to me and says, oh, you want to go take the dance to the dance floor? And I'm like, <laughs> Not really. <laughs> and so we got on the dance floor. And I'm there with my, my big bunny hips and my little bunny tail. And I'm shaking it. And we started the dance party. Everyone started. Then we were the only ones on the dance floor. And then we brought the party. So it was that was cool. We got to That's really awesome. That sounds like so much fun. <laughs> It was. It was a good Saturday night. And I came home. I don't, my family knew I was doing something. They always know I'm up to something. And when I came home, <laughs> they looked at my face. They're like, what were you doing tonight, honey? 
<laughs> they had all the, the bunny whiskers and stuff. Yeah. They didn't That's see you cool. in your bunny costume. No, but it was it was funny when we were pulling in, we got we got there and they said like they had us park in a weird spot in the back of the building and they said you're you're probably not going to find it. Let's we're going to send an escort for you. That's Longwood Garden. They're, they're so such a a class act. So they sent what we thought we thought it was the escort, but there was this car that pulled in front of us. You know, we were waiting pulled over and then so we started following this car. And we're following and I'm there with my little bunny face on following the car. <laughs> and finally the guy pulls over and he comes out. He says, are you guys following me? <laughs> we said, aren't you our, our escort? <laughs> and he's like, no, I'm the electrician. Head trip. Like I'm being followed by a rabbit. <laughs> <laughs> Poor guy. He felt thought he fell down the rabbit hole. So, <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry. Can you take us where we're going? He was a gentleman. He was like, oh, oh yeah, where are you trying to go? I'll get you there. But I was like, <laughs> he probably is thinking like, am I seeing things? Or am I and the escort's there? probably going, where is these people? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. That's funny. Yeah, we were laughing. We oh, were my laughing. God. Sounds like a How was your week, though, Teresa? This weekend, I just... I did a pop up with Don yesterday. That was a lot of fun. And Saturday we went out, but I don't remember where. I'm old. <laughs> <laughs> did you guys celebrate St. Patrick's Day at all? No, no, I didn't. You're not Irish, you guys? Yeah. We, I didn't yeah. even wear green for the auction yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> Neither did I. You know, now that I don't work out the house anymore, yeah. you know, for the man. And it's like I used to wear green and you know and stuff, yeah. but it's like now it's, it's just a vor green. vortex of time and space, right? right. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, I did the oh, it's March seventeenth. Right, oh, man, <laughs> this year's gone too fast. That's about all I did. I know. I'm thinking, wow, my life is not as exciting as Becky's. <laughs> <laughs> Mine either. I just. I sit here, have sales, go to source. Oh, that's what we did. We went sourcing. Oh, that um, well, that is like the that would be the highlight of my weekend. I love sourcing. <laughs> I do too. And I, don't do do it. Help. I don't like my checkbook after the fact, oh, no. but um, <laughs> it's fun while you're doing it. Yeah. Where did you go? Just thrift stores around. Okay. We don't have. I have to drive two hours for um the bins, so okay. we just went to local. We go to small thrift stores i don't do the goodwill and i do like home uh, small companies like mom and pop thrift stores dog foundation thrift stores like mm -hmm. that right you get better deals that way so you're smart yeah and they Mama to know, is yeah. open today so they only open on monday oh but it's hard on mondays because i got so much other stuff to do yeah. you know it's up. like, can you open like one? But they do stay open till six o'clock. So, so I constantly out like of things out. Huh? I keep you out of trouble by having you here. Yeah, you do. <laughs> I know. That's funny. You'll get there. Hmm. Ashley, I went to a thrift store that Jennifer actually told me about. She says, "Oh, you know, right by us, there's a there's a new um, Value Village, but it's it's like owned by Value Village, but it's called Prime Thrift." And so I went for the second time. I was like, all right, Jennifer, let's let's see. What do we got? What do we got? And I have to tell you, like, this is, so this is only the second time I'm there. But every time I'm there, the prices are crazy town. Like, there was a George, which is what, like, Walmart brand, right? Kids jacket for, like, $30. And I was like, wow. what in the world? It's George. Like, it didn't even cost that much at Walmart. for Right. I was going to say, that's higher than Walmart. I know. Good Walmart. Yeah. And it's like, really? So, but they do a lot of color days, like where there's discounts and stuff. Right. And so I think that that's how it all works out is like they started out high and then they do the color yeah. discounts and stuff. Yeah, Dude, you're funny. <laughs> Becky's here and I'm tired already. <laughs> I had to put that up. I had to. <laughs> you don't have to live in this in this skin. It's exhausting. At least you get a break from me. <laughs> your poor husband. <laughs> Oh Ashley goodness. said she cut, they cut grass all weekend. Is this the, Ashley, is this the first time you got your grass done? I don't know where you live. I feel like we get a nice break from that during the winter months. And then yeah. it's like the first nice weekend it's on. I know I was, was so tall. The clovers and everything was so tall. My neighbor passed and he, 
his grandparents used to live in the house next to me. So he just keeps up the yard and stuff. And he goes, I think spring has sprung, you know? So finally my son came and it's like, I'm like about time because my other neighbors like, you didn't catch grass yet. You know, oh, you're, you're those neighbors. <laughs> yeah. One of those neighbors. It's like nobody else cares. At you least know. you have a, a son who will do it for you. You don't have to do it yourself. Right. That's the only thing he does. No, I'm just kidding. He, oh. <laughs> he doesn't live. Well, he lives here, but that's my little riverboat captain. So when oh. he's, he's home, he comes and uh, he lives on the boat most of the time. And then he'll come home for a day or so. Well, Is he really fun. a riverboat captain? That's yeah. an awesome, awesome career. Well, that's he, cool. He's got, I think he's got maybe one month left. Like he's in his clinic, you know, a nurse would be in clinicals. Oh, no. So okay. he's done all the footwork. So now he's just yeah. got to put in so many hours with that the master. Was, yeah. And then he said, I think he said about a month more and then he'll have his master's captain's license. Oh, that's good. Congratulations. Yeah, but he, awesome. he works a hundred and something hours a week sometimes, mm -hmm. you know, I'm like, dude, you're killing yourself. But yeah. he's on the live on boat. So, you know, that's good. A yeah. live on boat. That Keeps must him out of trouble that way. Cool. That's true. Unless, a, unless there's some cute deckhands, I don't know. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know. Live on, live on. It's hard work. I mean, sometimes he's out there doing the work of a whole crew because people didn't show up. And he goes, mm -hmm. and he's like, they'll be pushing like forty something barges down the river, and then he's like, he walks the tops of them while they go. And I'm, mm -mm. Yeah, no, be that'd cool. be enough. I don't. I try not to think about him because he drives like a crazy person. So he's safer on the river than he is on the road, you know, and he respects the river because they, I, I hope none of his, I hope his bosses don't aren't watching. They're like, he drives like a lunatic. <laughs> oh, I, think that, I think they know license. because he had to pick up his captain one day and I drove with them. We went with him somewhere. Was it last week? I was sitting in the back seat. And my husband kept hitting him. Your mom's in the car. <laughs> I, was like, I had to do this because I, if I looked up, I was like, oh, my God. You know, it's like, Did you keep slamming him? And he's speeding up. Yeah. Were you hitting the mom, the mom brake pedal? You know, like whenever I my legs were so sore the when I got out, I think because my muscles were so tight trying to put the brakes on. And then my husband would go, your mom's in the car. <laughs> My mom and I went to a um, a scrapbooking event two weeks ago, which was so fun. I, I hadn't been to like a big scrapping event with, with her ever. And I hadn't been to a large one in a while, but it started pouring. It was actually pouring all day, but especially when we went to leave. And of course you had, everything's paper. So we're like, no, our precious paper, you know? <laughs> so what I said, mom, do you want me to drive? Cause it was really coming down. She says, she says, okay. But I should have qualified it with like, do you want me to drive? And are you going to like be okay? In the car while I'm because she was like, can you slow down? Can you slow down? But there's like a point where if you go too slow, the water's just hitting you then. So I'm like, mom, I'm, I'm okay. But like, you're freaking me out. <laughs> oh, anyway. Oh my goodness. Have you ever, John, have you ever watched that show Below Deck? It's, yes, my husband yeah. loves that show. I was good. That's what I was thinking about with your son. There's some, you know, there. There's always some romance. Oh no, he, he's on a tugboat. He's a, okay. like a tugboat captain. So it's yeah, like, there's, there's nothing, nothing fun about what he does. You know, <laughs> I think his most exciting thing is that he goes to Sam's and he buys like two cases of um, Monster. And oh, I'm thinking, okay. okay, well that just tells the story right there. Yeah, you know? okay. <laughs> Oh my god, no, it's not fancy at all. Mm -hmm. Not fancy. Welcome in, Deborah. Thank you for coming by. Hey, Deborah. Yeah, he'll call me and he goes, Mom, how do you cook this? So that's the day he got stuck in the kitchen. Oh, boy. and he goes, How long do I need to cook such and such? And what's the temperature? I'm like, Well, at least he's calling and you know, yeah. he wants to cook something decent. <laughs> yeah, how old is he? They feed him good on the boat, I tell you that. How old is your son? He's uh, 34. Okay. No, I'm sorry. He's 30, 30. He's in his early 30s. Early 30s. I know. I was somewhere with my daughter. I'm like, how old are you? you know. yeah. After it's a certain like, age, you stop counting. Right. I have to ask my husband, how old am I going to be? I do the same thing. And I think I, I celebrated so. my... What year was it? I celebrated my like 38th year twice or something. I was like, oh, I thought this was the year. <laughs> I was like, right. Well, I'll be 61. And then I was saying I was going to be 62. So I'll be 61 in September. So I think I'm 59. In Forever. September. 
In November, <laughs> I mean. I don't know. Cool. I don't pay attention to it. So When's your close? birthday, Teresa? Are you a November baby? Yes, November 8th. I'm the 4th. Oh. Yeah. Hi. Teresa and I have so much in common. Like, it's remarkable. Us Scorpios. Watch out. That's why we get along so well, because we're both a little, a little crazy. And from New York, yeah. <laughs> I guess that's where the crazy comes in. <laughs> well, I don't know. I, I, can, <laughs> I, don't, I know my reasons. I don't, you're, you're not crazy. I know my reasons for being crazy. <laughs> yeah. It's both my oldest, my 13-year-old, and my 11-year-old. That's There it is. Oh, yeah. Those <laughs> are the crazy, crazy days. Yeah. That's when the aliens come and get them and don't oh, bring them my. back until they're in their 20s. Oh, my. <laughs> or, no. or whenever. Yeah. Or whenever. <laughs> whenever. <laughs> <laughs> if they come back. Yeah. It was funny. The other day I was, um, I did some, I had my tablet like in a weird spot and I was like, okay, I had all these things in my hand when I got up and I was like, I have to remember my tablets here because I'm never going to find it again because it's in such a weird spot. Right. So then of course I didn't come back and put it away because I got sidetracked with all the zillions <laughs> of other things. Kelsa Priest. And then later on that day, I was like, dang it, where's my tablet? And, I was like, <laughs> and then I was like, hold on. I remembered. I told myself, remember this because it's in a weird spot. I was like, oh, Becky, yeah, you actually remembered something. I was like throwing yourself a party for remembering something. I don't know. My, my son tell me that his mom, okay. mom, you're not yeah. listening, are you? And I'm like, what? <laughs> <laughs> you're just like grandma. You... <laughs> but they talk low and I can't hear them, you know, or I had you know, fusion in my neck, so I can't turn. And they stand behind me. Ma, look at this. And I'm like, you know, I can't. You come turn here. Come you. around here. Yeah. Come around. You yeah. know. Yeah. But he's the one. My youngest. He's the one that likes to watch funny videos, or he sends me food videos all the day, all day. You know, mom, wouldn't this be good? Mom, wouldn't this? And of course, they're all ramen kind of noodle, kind of noodle-ish stuff. Right. You yeah. know, a very hot, spicy Cajun noodles but they're all noodles <laughs> well tell them that that sounds good why don't you try it out like let's that's what I, told them. I said you can cook that you yeah. know <laughs> let funny. me know what you think of it give it a go oh i didn't it's get remarkable. my coffee yet from my, my second cup of coffee yet because thomas is still sleeping so. well thomas better get up so you can get that's what i'm talking about i need that second cup so i can be energized like becky i know because I this coke zero is not doing it okay <laughs> no all right, you guys want to get this party started? Thank right. you, everybody, for coming in. Yeah. We're going to start with Becky. We all use PayPal, and we all use Pirate Ship. And I ship from New York. Becky ships from PA, and Don ships from Louisiana, if you haven't caught on yet. <laughs> <laughs> and, we'll, we'll, and Becky will tell you a little bit more about whatever she wants to tell you about in a minute. I'm going to yeah. set a time. Are you ready, Becky? I am ready. Yeah, I'm ready to go as as usual. I'll give you kind of like the rules for the insanity. Because if I sit here much longer, we're just going to be talking the whole show. <laughs> Which is fine too. Yeah. Because if you know me, you know, I, I like to chat and, and all that stuff. But um, I guess we're here for a reason, right? So my name is Becky. If we're new to getting to know each other, um, like Teresa said, I do live in Pennsylvania and I ship from PA as well. I want to say thank you to Teresa and Dawn for having me. It's, it's always fun. I really could chat with you guys like for forever, but it's always yeah. fun to be selling with people who I enjoy spending so much time with. Um, I have a unique business in that I'm a full-time reseller, not only of my own things, but I also have a consignment component to my business, which means that I sell not only my own things, but items for others as well. And that's most of what I'm showing today will be things on consignment. And I do also partner with a nonprofit. So every once in a while, I'll have something that's available that uh, the proceeds then go back to the nonprofit as well. Um, I am a reseller, so I can be a stay-at-home mom. So this is kind of my, my passion. I fell into reselling a little bit accidentally and I'm just loving every second of it. I'm loving that I have friends now with you guys and that I get to spend time and actually like connect with my buyer, which I think is unique, like compared to selling on some of the other platforms. So um, thank you for having me, but thank you also for um, looking at my things. Uh, it helps support me to be a stay at home mom, which is my dream. And um, I do ship with PayPal. Uh, I'm sorry, I ship with Pirate Ship. I get the lowest price possible. I will put I will put things in the safest, smallest packaging because you pay what I pay. So I try to get the shipping costs really, really low. 
And then I do use PayPal for processing. I also like Venmo if you have that, but otherwise it can be flexible. Last but not least, if you haven't noticed, I talk quickly. <laughs> so if I am speaking too fast and you want me to go back and repeat something, just let me know. But all of the items for now, I think I have some things on auction, but for now, all of the things are buy it now. So I will be choosing a letter for each item and then I will be assigning it a price. Your job as the viewers is to keep me <laughs> organized and make sure I don't forget which letter I'm on because stranger things have happened. There'll be a test <laughs> later. Be a yes, test later. Because I'm sure <laughs> she's going to say, what was I on? Yes. But we'll, we'll, <laughs> we'll, we'll see how we do. We'll try our best. And then also at some point I will um, do like a round where it's like all a dollar um, and then I'll give things keywords, which I'll probably do coming up soon. So here we go from the start. I tried to stay organized and have things kind of all together. And then I got disorganized while I was bringing more me, items. Out. She's making me feel like I'm doing it wrong. She's organized and she's got a schedule and I have to remember stuff. Oh, no. 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 I'm with you, Teresa. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, they say fake it till you make it. So like maybe if I just put out like this juju that I have things together, maybe it'll start happening. So uh. <laughs> all right, my first item and I am reversed again today. So I'm going to try to remember at some point I'll try to flip my screen and see if it helps. But we see it. Remember. No, it's showing right. It's showing right. Right. But so I, uh, when I want to go, if I want to bring this to this yeah okay this is yeah you're right okay yeah so maybe my brain is just flipped yeah we're <laughs> backwards to ourselves yeah which is a scarier problem okay my first item is letter a it's four dollars it is a pair of texting gloves i know winter is over and i want these out of my house <laughs> they are texting gloves with the tips of the um first three fingers have just a slightly different color and material so that it actually registers the texting. I know winter's almost gone, but they are brand new and they're a great item to just tuck in the back of the closet for next year. It is letter A, $4. Hello to everybody coming in. Hi, Maritza. Maritza, I think you and I spoke Spanish together once, didn't we? If I'm remembering correctly. Hola. <laughs> so my girlfriends are trying to teach me Spanish and es no bueno <laughs> trying and um the other day they taught me how to say culito which is or culi which is like the word for butt like oh you like shake your culito and then someone told me no in puerto rico that's like a bad, like a bad word so I've, been, I've been walking around cursing at everybody calling everyone the a word i'm like oh dear so you just you can't help me all right next item is letter b $15. I hope you don't mind. I will pepper in ridiculous stories throughout our <laughs> sales experience today. Sorry, not sorry. This is no, a we're supposed to have fun. I know, you're right? Yeah. Great. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. I'm going to show you the earrings in a second. This was kind of the best way to show this stone. And I apologize if my coloring is off. I feel like I'm okay, but I think I'm, I look more distorted on my end. It is black, but it's kind of like a tiger's eye effect a little bit. And then look at the matching earrings. How cute is letter B and it's $15 for the set. And they're a little bit dangly. Aren't they just so it's precious? Cute. Yeah, it is cute. So this they is like little purses. Yep. And it's, yeah, they do actually. That's, that's right. And they're on a laps, a lobster claw closure and it's like a charcoal gray pewter kind of color chain. So that's letter B $15. Let me just put this away so it stays organized. Now I pulled out some things for Easter or for springtime, really, I should say. But this is kind of like an Easter dress. This is, oh, I know. Look how darling it is the size. Oh, hang on. 48 months. That was not ridiculous that they put 48 months on a dress. It's a, <laughs> it's a four. <laughs> it's, a, it's, four. Um, it's a polka dot little Easter dress. And it is $6, letter C. I'll hold it up closer in a second. I just want to make sure I'm writing it down. The brand is Jessica Ann, which I believe might be vintage, but I'm not 100% sure. And it has these cute little flowers on the waistband, and it is a tie waist. I end up, 
every year when my kids were this age, when they were younger, I would buy like so many different Easter outfits because invariably they get them dirty. Like when you go Easter egg hunting or if you go out for brunch and then, you know, you need something else for pictures and whatever. So this is a darling little dress. I will say some of the polka dots, you can see that they wore off just a little bit, but otherwise it's in perfect condition. Letter C, six dollars. That's just too adorable. I that love any, anything girly, girly, girly. Also, if you hang around me for a little while, you kind of know I love polka dots. <laughs> so those are like, I guess, my my two weaknesses. Letter D, eight dollars. This is handcrafted. Look at how darling it is. Hello, Aww. Kitty. <laughs> Oh, that is adorable. Hey, Hi, Bula May. Hello, everybody. Isn't this the cutest thing? I know the woman who made this locally, and she just does amazing, amazing work. The stitch work on this is just beautiful. You'd think it was made like in a on a machine or something. Um, it's got this cute little bow. Of course, Hello Kitty has a bow. And it is $8 letter D. She got the eyes stitched on with little lashes little nose and then the two sides this is another one that it's the end of the season but these hats never go out of style so it's probably about the size i think it would fit maybe like a between a four-year-old and an eight-year-old depending on the size of the head it would stretch out a little bit as well so you that is many seconds left eight dollars letter d how many seconds 20 20 seconds. All right. Last but not least, I will show for $1. And this will be a $1 keyword. You can put the keyword monkey. It is a set of embellishments for paper crafting. There's a monkey and a robot and a sailboat, rocket ship. They're all different sizes. And keyword for this is monkey. And it's a set of miscellaneous assorted embellishments. What else do we see there? What's this guy? a gear and oh look at he's a little crocodile and there's a car let me see them all and they're metal trimmed embellishments with the little um flap that closes on the side so they just lock into place on your page keyword monkey okay my name is idaho your we got, we got the whole crew here look at everybody coming Hi, in this idaho Yay. welcome in you is that my time Teresa? That's your time, and we're going to throw right. you on up. Be ready, Don. Yes. I'm going to set Good you morning, set everybody. Party. You want to do All that? All right. Too? So y'all know I ship from South Louisiana and part ship PayPal. And if anybody needs extra time, let me know, you know, for your invoice or whatever. Um, all I ask is that you let me know. That's cool. So anyway, let's see. Where am I going to start? I'm gonna I'll start your six minutes. All right, cool. Start away. Okay. That way we can fit in more. We fit in more. All right. I have oh, this. This is a Pier 1 set. I need to move things out of my house, guys, because I have to move out to move back in after. So, $8. Pier 1. It has the, the holder, the teapot. Here one. Um, we had the discussion yesterday. I don't know how old Pier One stuff is because they do sell them. I've been having this one quite a while. Nice size cups. So um, such a pretty color too. Isn't it pretty? It's like a brown with a little bit of a reddish tint to it, kind of that reddish hue. Yeah. So um, very pretty. Four. It comes with four cups. And the teapot and the holder, eight bucks. It is a little heavy, so just be aware of that with shipping. But you pay what I pay and uh, not a penny more. So the next thing I have, I'm trying to show you guys some stuff other than jewelry or whatever. Um, this is a Heather Goldman piece. Um, it is signed, I think, I think, which... You can put it like over a candle or one of those um, little battery candles. And I will do $10 for this. 
It is uh, made in 2000, so it has little holes all throughout. That has a cord thing. You could put fairy lights in it and have the Yeah, you could. Thing. It does have a little spot. So I don't know if it once had a lamp oh, under it. There's fairy lights in it. Yeah. Fairy lights would be adorable in it. So because it has all the little windows and things. And I just fell in love with it. So it says boutique. So it's like a little boutique. And That's the little cool. doors open. So it's really cute. So what did I say? I don't know what I said. $10. Ten dollars. That's good for that. I know personally. It, it's it's really cute. It is cute. And it's that big. I'm using DD measurements today for the most part. If you need me to actually measure it, please let me know. And then, y'all, this piece is gorgeous. It is handmade by someone. Mm -hmm. It is faceted acrylic beads. So there's clear. There's like a silver and a black. It is so sparkly. It has a toggle clasp. And I will do five dollars. Wow. It's, it's like a choker. It's very pretty. Isn't it pretty? So five dollars. Buy it now. All this is buy it now, guys. Quinceañeras, birthday party, mm -hmm. Easter. Um look at these guys. I love these. They are vintage clip earrings. Hey, Donna. Donna is my sister. Oh, so we have, I'm going to just turn her blue then. Aren't these gorgeous? So oh, this wow. is like in a, like a little plasticky acrylic -y piece with the little uh, rhinestones. And, you know, I can always see better when it's up on the screen. So all the rhinestones are there. That's pretty. And they are clip. They are unmarked, as far as I can tell. And I'll do $5 for these. Yeah, they're unmarked, but these are really pretty. You have two minutes. Okay. Those are real pretty. And let's see. So this piece, I will do $5. It is... It's an Avon piece. Come on. Focus. So it is a cubic zirconia in a cage. Looks like a starburst. Isn't that pretty though? It's very delicate, dainty. Um, so as I said, it is Avon. It is new. Um, I don't know how old this piece is for Avon. I don't think it's really old, but um, let's see if I can show you this way. I don't have pretty fingernails like Teresa. And it comes in its box. I do have for sure two of these. And it's called Cross cubic zirconia caged necklace. That's what it's Aww. called. This one doesn't have an outer little thing. So I have two for sure. I think I may have another one. What a cute gift for twin sisters, mom and daughter. Right. right. And then I have this piece. I'll do $3 on. It is, um, it is unmarked. It has a lobster car claw clasp. It is a three-strand necklace, and uh, I don't know why that one bead is a little wonky. Maybe it's twisted at the at the end. Oh, it, it is. Yeah. yeah, but very pretty. It is faceted acrylic beads with some seed beads. It is like a brownish copper color, and. So this one real quick. This one is an acrylic. They're cold. I'm not sure. I don't think they're stone. I think they're faceted acrylic, really nice acrylic beads. The lady who made these had it priced at 60 bucks. So I don't know. It has this beautiful cross. It's very long. And I will do $6 for it. 
And that was your time. Oh, okay, that's dokey. real pretty, though. Thank you. And yeah, maybe I should have wore this yesterday for my green. It's like a teal aqua color. This All be. right. Thank you, ma'am. Okay, it is my turn. I set the timer for six minutes. Apparently, I set it twice for myself. So if I miss it the first time, <laughs> there you go. There I go. And I am so grateful you all came in. If I missed you, please don't take it personal. I just can't keep up with the chat sometimes. I have this. This is on uh, a piece for five dollars. Buy it now or buy it now. Starting. No, that's a buy it now. Can I say buy it now and starting? It's I don't know what it's made out of, just metal. It, this is wire. The dream catcher part is wire. It's not real. I don't. It's not real. I mean, I'm freezing, so I couldn't even tell you if they're cold. But it's very pretty. It's this big. Let me show you. Let me get a measurement of that. A drop. It's a long drop. It's about 24 inches, I think. Lisa, welcome in. Welcome. Hey, Lisa. In. Oh, Lisa, you should email me. 16 inches drop, so it is an 18 inch chain. Again, that is $5. I have an articulated owl. It is $8. Cute. He's got the little eyes. Try to get the eyes on there. They're really shiny. Articulation. This is what the back looks like. This is what the back looks like. If it wants to cooperate, there you go. You wear it this way for Halloween. He's a ghost. And this way. He all bends up. And there's no name on this one either. And that's eight dollars. And I set myself up all on trays today. And I have this for five dollars. This is uh, it'll stand on the end right here like this. Oh, that's beautiful. It does have some scratching and stuff. Let me see it in here. That's why it's only five dollars. And it is acrylic. But I might even see my son does resin and I have a dear friend that does resin. If this doesn't sell, I'm going to see if they can't fix that by sanding it down. And it's really pretty. You could see it a little bit there. Maybe even a good polish like with a, yeah. like a Dremel polisher or something like that. Yeah. I, I don't know how to. I don't have a Dremel but I just thought it was so pretty. I'd offer it up and see. And that's a four by four square. I have to assume. Because I didn't measure it. And I have this bronze cross. That this is gorgeous. Is $12. This is a vintage. I do believe it's real. But I cannot, I cannot say that. Because I am not a gemologist. But everything I find on it says it is, but it's turquoise, bronze, this red, I don't know. We're going to go with a coral color, a turquoise color, and a red ball. Cabochon, and the back is gold tone bronze or brass. It's just really pretty. It's got a nice size loop. And that is twelve dollars. I used my puzzle puzzle sorter to hold all my stuff. And then I have this necklace, five dollars. It's a drop necklace. It is not named. And it has all the little charms on here. It is long as well. We'll say 19 inches with that. That one comes with the little case. And that is $5. You get this one and the case. So 
that's five dollars for that. Did I say five dollars? Yes, I said five dollars. And this is a clean case. This is an Ipsy case. If you know Ipsy, you know that they sell makeup and all that kind of stuff. They put it in a case every month. This was not used, but it does come with this necklace for five dollars. And I have 50 seconds left, guys. So I have magnets. Each magnet is $2. I do have more of the America, Salute America magnet. Father's Day is coming up. They are wood magnets on magnets. Hi, Red Road. Welcome in. Thank you for coming. And you got the goose, you got the eagle, you got the two fish going in opposite directions. They had a fight. And that's that. And nobody is interested in that. We'll call that a pass as well. And my that'll be my last item for this round. I thank you all for coming. Hi, Janice. Good morning. And we're back to our Becky. Hi, Janice. Hey, Janice. Hey, Red Road. I don't think I know Red Road. I know Janice. It's good to see you again. Uh, Red Road, it's good to meet you. It's nice to meet new friends. And I, I think I know everybody else. I feel like, you know, I guess when I started living in my area for a little while, I felt like I didn't know anybody. And then once I started like recognizing people out at the store, I was like, oh, I feel like these are my people. <laughs> and I feel like now <laughs> you guys are my people. I know enough of you that I feel like, okay, these are my, these are my buddies. That's great. Well, All right. I tried <laughs> you, whether you like it or not, you're my people. <laughs> I like it. Whether that's a good thing or not is for you guys to determine. <laughs> <It's good. laughs> All right. I tried to stay organized. Again, I'm trying here. I'm trying. Fake it till you make it. Um, I remembered what letter I was on. So this hey, is Ella. E. Fifteen dollars. Hi, Ella. Thank hey, you for coming. Ella. Ella's here with her blanket. <laughs> um, this is a drop earring, and it is blue. I don't know if is it showing blue or is it showing more on like the black. It's showing blue? like a bluish. Yeah, you blue. can tell it's blue. Really deep blue. It's That's on a beautiful. long chain. Yep, I'll take it off so you can see. With a um, lobster closure, it's a silver chain. I'll show you the back real quick as well. And it just sits. Flash, I'll take it off so you can see. And let me know if you want me to measure. But it is a pendant. It is, it's long. This is one that's going to look just gorgeous with a pretty dress or um, Easter, any holiday, really. So pretty and the letter is e15 dollar your your mind <laughs> <laughs> hey janice all right next actually let me be really careful with this. i'm gonna put this down here but next up is letter f is seven dollars for and you, if you guys are crafters in the chat, you guys will have to tell me more about this. You, you know, I do this from time to time where I'm like, I have something. I think I know what it is, but I'm not really quite sure. The brand is Speedball. And you guys know I sell a lot of craft items for my consigners. And this is one of those items. It is a foam, um, like pressure roller. And it is used. You can see that there's, so is it for spreading paint? On that, it's from Speedball. It's most likely yeah. for screen silk screening. Silk screening. Okay, because yeah. I thought it might have been like for, um, you know, the embossing folders or like like if you need to like press down on something, no. you know, put pressure. So you, this right. is for for spreading ink. Okay. For ink. Spreading ink. Yeah. All right. You can use well, it on a gel mat too, and you can use it to spread your ink on a, an embossing too. A brayer. Denise says a brayer. Brayer. Okay. okay. See. It's it's like when you're on what's that show like Survivor when they're like phone a friend. <laughs> just have Janice to wants to know if you got her email and Facebook. Oh, I didn't. So I'm not really on Facebook. So I ha but I haven't seen a message there. But I will check my email. I haven't. Um, I'm glad that you that you reached out because I was having trouble 
I was emailing someone. I don't know if it was you or not, but I was emailing someone. When it's not my turn, I'll, I'll check for you. Thanks for reaching out, Janice. I appreciate it. Oh, and I Twitch said you can use, use it for a diamond art roller. Like after you finish your your piece, you oh, use the brayer over it so that it pushes them down and make yeah. sure they're all attached. That's a good idea. I don't know what gel plates are, but I know you mentioned it too, Teresa, like to, to press it in. Okay. Well, now I have my education and I'm going to list this. I saw them listed for more on eBay, but I thought I would take it here first in case there were crafters in my, my craft community. Um, but I did see that there were some online, so I'm going to have to make sure I put it and label it as a brayer <laughs> now that I know what the heck that is. <laughs> Thanks, guys. You too can be an online reseller. <laughs> okay, letter G is four dollars, and it is a tank top because it's that time of year. Cute. The, the size is medium, and it's funny. I just saw somebody wearing this, and I said, "Oh, I'm selling that." And she's, I was like, "It's cool to see it on somebody." And she's like, "Oh, I love this top. It is a, um, it's probably deeper than it's showing up on camera, like a, a deep turquoise blue." And I'll show you, it's flowy and it's a size medium, but I think it's more like a size large. I took the measurements. It is 21 inches pit to pit, which is more of like a size large measurement. And then 27.5 from shoulder to hem. So it does cover down below the bootay and it is letter G, $4. I'll show you the back. It's that time I'm transitioning all of my inventory. Um, the new things I'm listing, I'm listing all shorts and tanks and all that good stuff. Letter G, $4. And it is brand August Silk, and it is a medium. Can we bid? Yeah. Why not? <laughs> I'm you missing can... the letter, but I want that. <laughs> it's a letter G, $4. It's buy it now, so... Um, it's it's yours if no one else wants it. <laughs> I'll, I'll let you guys fight over it. <laughs> okay, right. Dawn, we're going to be taking Dawn out back if anybody else is interested. That's right. <laughs> taking Dawn. Anybody out else back. can have it, but if not, I'll take it. If Thank not, you, then, then you know we'll let her back in the house. All right, she's back. She got it. We'll start that for you in the back. <laughs> we're just Thank fun you. around here. We're not like strict. Amen. Life is too short to not have some fun. <laughs> Next up, letter H is $1. It is a bag of embellishments. This is like Mardi Gras colors. It's the purple and blue and green and gold. And they're all different size squares. And it's a really full pouch. And this is cute for like if you ever do those um, bomb cards that like glitter bomb. <laughs> yeah, glitter yes. bomb explode at you. Or just for filler, like if you're giving someone a cute little birthday card and put a put a couple of these in there and let the kid open them up and, and enjoy and having a, a vacuum. Yeah, <laughs> right. That's that's mom's that's mom's problem, right? <laughs> no, I'd let the kid do it. There you go. Vacuum. <laughs> or pick yeah. them up by hands. You could put oh. them in um, clear balloons as the balloons blow up, and then they just kind of like hang out in the bottom. Gosh, what else could you use these for? Like you could use them on um, paper crafting with like the little clear. Envelopes, so many different options. Letter Snow H, globe. $1. One Ooh, yes. Snow globe. Snow I haven't done one of those in a long time. Did you say one minute? Yep. All right, talk fast. <laughs> Letter <laughs> I. <laughs> Do it. Letter I is $6. These are size 3T Jimbery. Oh, so cute. So, cute. so precious with this little citrus. Um, slice pocket they are elastic in the back so they allow for little kids to grow and they are um Jimbery, which if you know Jimbery, they're just a really good brand so six dollars letter i little girl shorts and they are 3t season's coming i have to change my own personal wardrobe change everything over from sweaters and long sleeve to yeah, we were talking about that today as well. And I'm like, I pulled out the sweater. I'm freezing. Yeah, this is like that weird transition season where like you want something to throw over to stay warm. But like it's then I, like, I'll go out and be like, the sun is shining. I'm dying. Why should I wear a sweater? So like I take it on, I take it off. I take it on, I take it off. But that's what spring and fall are good for. And that's my time. No, you got 44 seconds left. Oh, 44 no, seconds. Come on. 
I'm going to show one more. I thought you said I had a minute. Hold on. You okay. Did, but Let, letter J. <laughs> letter J. J is $1. It is a bag of another bag of embellishments. These are leaves. And here's a, on the back. You can see all the different shapes. It looks like we have a gecko and a fern. And then don't ask me any of the others. <laughs> it's a bracken fern, actually. There you go. And they're just like little leaf shapes but these would just be so darling on a paper craft page and i think they're a little bit i guess i can open it up they're like a little bit uh no they're yeah they're a little bit see-through oh, oh cool. those are cool all right yeah. that was your timer boop, boop, boop. see i got one more in that's letter j one dollar thanks guys all right go. yes hit that thumbs up y'all yeah, yeah. all right yeah, I'm all over the place with what I'm showing today. So just kind of pardon me. <clears throat> a friend's puzzle, $5. 500 pieces. Um, it's by Aquarius. That's a cool puzzle. It's got everybody in it. Cool. So $5 for that. Just you can put puzzle, whatever. Um, I'm easy. Let me show you this. This is um glass figure, hand blown figure. Let's see if I can show it. It is a dragon and a wizard. I will do eight dollars on this. It's on a mirror. That is cool because that's hand blown there, too. Yes, it is. There's no cracks, no chips. So if you're a uh, dragon wizard kind of person, go for it. That's right, Jana. Put those thumbs up. Okay, so that's eight dollars. Let me put it back here for safekeeping. And then I have another one. This will be five, and it is this little kitty cat. The ears, the whiskers, the little uh, bow tie, and the tail are gold. It has gold, uh, whatever they, I guess they paint it over. I don't know if they use that in the glass or they put it on after. <clears throat> it is over glass a mirror. This is the bottom. It's that big. So, there you go. $5 for that. How about a diamond art? I'll do four dollars for this one. It is a kitty cat. The box is a little ratty, so I won't. I'll, I'll lower the price on this one. I came in a box. That's a good one. I know, right? But because the box is all ratty, I'll go ahead and let it go for four. Wow. Um, it has all the pieces to it. It is a cat. Can y'all make that out? Oh, yeah. That's pretty. It looks like it's on a tapestry. So pretty. Yeah. Doesn't it look like a tapestry? That is pretty. And the, the, beads, the beads are like really, really bright. So I think it's going to be a bright piece. Yes, you could, Tooch. We'll train you. Tooch, you can go fast, honey. All right. Uh, let's see what else I got. This. I do four dollars for these. It is a whole box. I don't think it goes in this box, but there are these little wooden butterflies that you can. Oh, oh so, so pretty. Those two. And I'm so demented that I just forgot what I said. But there's multiples. You said butterflies wouldn't in the box. I don't think you gave a price. Oh. Let's do four dollars. Those are pretty. Y'all counting? Because I'm not. No, I'm not counting. I'm just going, oh, how many cards can I make with those? Right. They are wooden and they do have a little hole. So you yeah. can even hang them in the little girl's room. That's true. Wait, there's more. Oh my gosh. You get a lot in there. So yeah, there's a lot. Wow, guys. Is there any interest in that? Because my next sentence is going to be. Dawn, put that in my box, please, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. You've got it. I better start making the cards I keep saying I'm going to make. <laughs> I know, right? Let's see. Let's 
after. Yeah. Which I think personally, it's a great deal. Five bucks. These little Honko bunnies. It's the whole family. So, and I can't hold them all at one time. So his mom and dad. I'll try. And then brother and sister. Those are adorable. Aren't they cute? Those are adorable. Donna, if you'd have had these when the twins were little, huh? Isn't they cute? Mom, dad, and the twins. You could put those right on the little side table with your yes. grass. As I said, they're number one four one four eight four from Home Co. For the set. Uh focus, focus, focus. Do they okay. still are they still around? Because those are vintage. Uh -huh. I know that. Yeah, I think people still have. They used to be like home interiors, they called it when we did. I used to have a party at least God, once every couple months. Oh, I used to do home and garden party. I, I sold that very well. Stuff. But Janice is in for four. Please put those. All right. In. I start. I'm starring the stuff in the back. This oh, little frog, five dollar brooch. And these little rhinestones. Five dollars. Oh, Janice, you deleted your comment. If you did not want that, was there something before that you wanted? Because you may be behind. Yeah, the, the bunnies. Did I say four? I, I don't think I said, said five. I think five, yeah. I you said five. What was your four right before that? Because you were out of The time. butterflies. Okay, Janice, did you want the butterflies? Because if you wanted the butterflies, she'll put you down for the butterflies. Because I noticed you retract your thing. Please make sure you're in live chat, not top chat. Because when you're in top chat... You miss out on chat. I know. I was in top chat. That was Look your at this last little item. bunny. I'm okay. That one right there. Okay. He's so stinking cute. He's by the mailbox. He's got I his little balloon. balloon. <laughs> that balloon is too cute. I know, right? I think his paint, he's not really chipped. It's like the paint is off. He is made out of resin, and I'll do five dollars for him. Isn't he cute? $5. Yeah, it's adorable. All right. You Thank you guys for looking. We just can't find things like that anymore. I know. These are vintage. Janice, please let us know what that was that you put the $4 in for. And yeah, so she retracted. Yeah, if you, if you still want it because it, it's fine. Um, I have $2 a piece. Little drab. Dinosaur cars. This is all I have left. I put them all out because they're different dinosaurs, but they're the clothes. Oh, she said it was the butterflies. Oh, you can have the butterflies. My husband really doesn't want me getting any more card stuff. Trust, <laughs> me. Trust me. If you still want them, they're yours. Okay. You got those dinosaurs like that. I don't know what they are. Then you got the Triceratops, if they still call it the Triceratops, because my son said they made it more complicated. And you got a Triceratops in yellow, and I got a Triceratops in pink. And I got this guy in yellow and this guy in pink. But do you know what these do? Oh, hold your horses. I'll tell you. Hold your dinosaurs. I'll show you. Yeah, and they make them in pink because girls like dinosaurs, too. That's right. Look, I pull it back. And it goes. And it wasn't because I'm tipsy. See, it's perfectly flat. Right into the bucket. These are. <laughs> it doesn't take much to amuse me. Two dollars each on those. Buy it now. I have the six left. My next item. I'm gonna put the camera down. Because it'll be easier for you guys to see. I have these crosses. These are $5 without the cord. $6 with the cord. I apologize for that. But I did pay for the cord. 
and these are glass this one is a stone this one is a stone and this one is a stone i don't know what stone they are but they are they're very pretty would make a great gift i like this one is multicolored. It, it's an ombre i'll bring this one closer it shows you the stone that's pretty and then you have the white i think it's coarse quartz i'm not sure and then you have this blue one there's not gold in it but i thought it was a lapis but apparently not because there's no gold in it hi pink rose <laughs> hi pink rose hi, Joyce. this is the ombre one and I have more of these if you need a different color or two of the same colors. And if you want the train. Oh, no, 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 no. Janice, please, seriously. Uh, no, I do not need the butterflies. <laughs> Dad's is probably going, take them. Take Dad's them, take going, them. please. Yeah, exactly. Please buy those, crucifix, buy those because uh, she does not need another butterfly. I have a wall full, literally, of card supplies. <laughs> Trust me, I don't need any more. So there you are. We're on Teresa's channel, uh, Pink Rose. And these are your choices. If you want a cross, please put cross and then the color, and I will get that to you. If you want the, the, the stone blue, put stone blue, and you get that one. And there's imperfections because it is a stone. Like you see that little flea bite right there. I think that's what we call it in the reselling community. And if you want the white one, you just put white one. But that that looks like a stone to me. Somebody told me it was quartz. The rest of these are glass. This one is a stone. So if you want the stone one, just yeah, put Yeah, that looks color. like rose quartz. Yeah. That's what I thought. It's one of the few that's stones that. I know. All right, Janice, I got you covered. Okay. That is that. And I have one minute left. Talk fast, girl. You can do it. This is a Monet. I'm going to start it at $5. It's Teresa's channel, Pink. It's my channel. Here's the, the name right there. Wait, maybe you could see it if I let you see it, if I hold it still, huh? Not Almost. <laughs> it moved. Right. Well, maybe not. All right. Well, it says Monet. Trust me. Five dollars, or this one is a um, oh that creek one. Some creek one. This is cold. Cold water cold creek. Water creek. <laughs> See, I know my jewelry, right? Some creek one. And this looks like real, whatever these are. Amethyst. These are five dollar start. Blue lap. Are they blue or purple? They look kind of bluey purple. Oh, okay. It's a technical term for I don't know if they're blue or purple. They kind of look more blue than they do purple, but maybe lapis? I don't know. But it's pretty. It's five dollars. And if there's no interest in that, I got 18 seconds left and I'll switch it to Becky. Let me switch to Hymo. Thank you guys for looking. Um, I am sending a I started typing and then I pressed enter. Premature sends. So I was just trying to put it in the chat. Janice, honey, thank you for, for emailing me. I didn't get an email. So um if you can just shoot me another email at, at New life reseller at gmail.com so I can make sure I have your email address correctly so I have the right person. I was trying to match, I think it's like a little dog in your um icon. I was like, I think it's the same dog who I'm emailing, but maybe not. Uh anyway, back to my letters. I remembered where I left off. Two for two, letter J, two dollars. It is a necklace. This is made with little clay beads. If you can see, each bead is like a tie-dye kind of um, multicolor green blue blend and they have little uh, spacer beads which I think are frosted glass and then small little blue beads throughout as well. I can measure if you're interested. Two dollars letter J 
lobster closure and this cute little dangling bead in the back as well. Two dollars, letter J. Like just in time for the sale. Here we are. All right, next item. I'm going to leave this in the bag. I hope you can see it okay. We give okay. It is letter K. Twelve dollars. Letter K. And you guys are going to laugh at this. It is a wooden sign. It says, it's all S's and giggles until somebody giggles and... <laughs> I love it. <laughs> it is such a funny sign. It's Perfect all... in your home. Yeah. <laughs> right. I think we've all had those <laughs> moments where you're like, uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm laughing too hard. It's usually the other the other thing. But right. Well, let me know if you need me to measure the... Um, width or the thickness. I just have it in this bag so that it doesn't get dinged up or scratched. It's um, like a tan wood tone and it is letter K. $12. It's all you know what's and giggles until someone giggles and you know what's. <laughs> <laughs> if that doesn't make you laugh, I don't know what, what will. All right. Next. Who's next? That was K. This is L. It is $10. It is a set of stamps that's called Good Neighbors. And it's a set of four, five, six, seven stamps. Is that right? Oh, no. You know what? The the roofs are separate. So it's four, seven, ten all together. And it is stamping up. And I'll show you individually what they look like. So they're cute little trees. It's the stamp name is good neighbors so it's all like little neighborhood so there's one here's two which is a roof to three which is a little house could you mix and match the roofs to the houses you can if you want to you so making a whole neighborhood i know and this one has like a little heart on their door another roof let's see what else we have we have little leaf and a cloud why can you never find a good cloud stamp when you need one? Cute cloud. Here's another house with a little roof. And another tree. So you can make a whole cute little village with all these little stamps. <laughs> $10. It's a full set. It's stamping up. It might be vintage. It doesn't say the name, but I don't think that this has been current for quite some time. I'm going to reassemble it and then attempt to show you all this. Stamp. Stampin' Up is a good brand, guys. Stampin' Up, did you guys hear uh, Close to My Heart is going out of business, but that Stampin' Up might be absorbing them? I saw so, that. Yeah. Yeah, that's been like rocking the crafting world. And Close to My Heart's been around for so long. And it's nice to hear that Stampin' Up is really kind of stepping up to help the employees and give them all jobs and some of that stuff. So, good. Um, yep. Speaking of being a good quality stamp company, they also have good morals and they're trying to help. So there's the full set of 10 and it is letter L $10, basically a dollar a stamp. Janice says, yes, you have a little black dog with a dress. Oh, I do. <laughs> it's wearing a dress. Okay. I think I have your email, right? So I will resend you another email in, um, when it's not my turn to make sure that we can finally finally land this plane and connect with each other. All right. That was L M is $5. And it is this darling little skirt. Look how cute. Oh oh. <laughs> Perfect for Easter and spring elastic waist. It's got this cute little bow detail at the front and it has in the underneath bloomers, which is every parent's dream for easy, um, Modesty Carter size 12, uh, 12 months that is, and it is letter M five dollars. So cute, really cute. And the colors are like a lime green, a navy, and a fuchsia pink. Next, okay, five dollars. I will keep it in its bag, and that was letter M, so this is letter N. 
I'm always afraid I'm going to write on myself if I keep my marker open. It is a hydrating facial mask with, with hyaluronic acid infused. The brand that is, is hard to read that. that. <laughs> Say that five times fast. Right? And it is um, made in Korea. It's one of the Korean baseline. If you know anything about Korean beauty, they are all about their... Uh, beauty masks, face masks, and all that kind of stuff. And this says, uh, here's, here's that boost of moisture on your skin. Hold on. Here's that boost of moisture on your skin's wish list. Infused with moisture binding hyaluronic acid, this mask helps revitalize win winter skin with plumping hydration. How to use. Unwrap the face mask, place it on a clean face for 10 to 20 minutes, remove mask, and rub in excess serum until absorbed and discard after use it's for one time only easy enough and your skin will love you for it it is 0.81 ounces letter and n five dollars korean face beauty and that was your timer oh perfect thanks Teresa. sorry i didn't warn you i wasn't paying attention it's okay Done. you're up okay all right i have another diamond art it comes in this little bag and i'm gonna show you the picture on my phone first it is a wolf with, he is a headdress on, or she. It, it is a big one. It will be $6. It has all the goodies inside. And it looks like it has little bags to put your drills in if you don't have the container or whatever. It is a landscape. That's pretty. So $6 for this one. It's 35 by 45 centimeters. And somewhere, I think it said in inches, but I think it's 2.2 .2 centimeters as an inch, something like that. Anyway, $6 if you want this guy. And I have uh, two of these. And I will put him back in the little bag after the show because I don't want to make a fool of myself trying to do it on. All right, I have this little bag of stones. And it has a little mushroom in there. That would be cute for a bonsai plant. Yes. They're that so cute. As far as I know, they're real stones. They're all cold. I go to this one little thrift store. And when I go to the jewelry, I start doing this. So I had to explain what I was doing. They were like, what are you doing? All right, Dawn. Now you have to explain to us what you're doing. <laughs> what are if you doing? Cold, if they're cold. What does that matter? Does it mean that they're real? Yes. Oh, okay. Okay, cool. Yeah, like That's my education. Plastic won't, plastic won't be cold. Uh, oh, right. Right. So, so this thing was between plastic or... Got it. Okay. Can you see? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, I put some cute. little... I put some little mushrooms in there. So it's an assorted and I oh, one to go behind the computer, but I will get it. So anyway, there's this little bag of them. There are some mushrooms in there. Um, well, I'll set them here until after because I can't get them back in the bag. Um, I have these adorable little earrings. One dollar. Oops. The little guitar. Oh, they're adorable. Aren't they cute? So it looks like they, they're like a brass tone. And it looks like maybe like resin is over the little guitar. So one dollar. 50 cents for each ear, but you have to buy two ears. <laughs> okay. Little kitty cat. That's so pretty. The paint job. He is, is vintage. Four dollars. His eyes are not glass, but they appear to be because they're glossed. He is a matte, or she is a matte finish. It is that big. It is small. It's not miniature, but it's small. One dollar. This little, it's like a paracord uh, bracelet. It's black and gray. It has the belt. I don't want to say hook and loop closure. I caught that one one time, didn't I? <laughs> I always forget. Um, this little clamper bracelet. Three dollars. 
it's enamel it's silver tone enamel it's like a, a pretty uh, teal aqua blue maybe more aqua than and pink hearts and yellow little polka dots two minute warning okay i have these adorable and i don't think i showed these today they are little unicorn earrings they have a starling post grateful little girl because they're tiny they're silver tone with a faux pearl and a sterling back and three dollars I have two for sure of these so this is going to be six dollars it's a, a car um, for your rear view mirror and it says nurses nurses on the go this would be great if you know a home health nurse that it would be i used to do home health back in my nurse days it's a different animal than working somewhere i bet i used to love it these little guys five dollars a piece or we'll do eight dollars for the set they're this big it is a little girl in a bunny she's look at her freckles y'all so cute she's got polka dots on her hat it's made in taiwan she is vintage this one is also he has polka dots on his hat he's carrying his little raggedy andy type doll he also has freckles but his aren't as dark as her freckles made in taiwan well this one is not marked she still has her sticker so that is that too i'll show you one of my six dollars this is one of the pens i make comes with a refill packaged in this package six dollars it writes black it's a really smooth um thing and here is another one i'm sorry that's your time when you're done okay. with that one so this one is pink it has glass beads and little sparklies and that these beads um uh, they're acrylic faceted blue and that thank you and they're very pretty and it's my turn. Let me start my timer. I've got this for $8. This would be a great gift. It is very heavy. It is glass. There's no chips, no damage. It comes gift boxed. I have three. If you put it on a light box, that would be really cool. I'm going to get it so you could see how... Oh, that's the back. See how it is. So pretty. It's got good weight to it. And it comes in the box. It perfectly fits in the box. Just when you open it, be careful because it is glass. And I've got three with three boxes. Let me put that over there. I have the best grandma. Angel stained glass for four dollars. It's real glass. This will come off before I go. And it's got the crinkled glass. The texture on the glass is on the on this side. There's an actual texture. It kind of I don't know if you can see the change in the colors. It's got the cabochon head. This is metal. It's not plastic. Best grandma. I have Easter egg hunt. Three dollars. Little Easter egg hunt sign. This is... Five and a half inches wide from the hanger. It is nine and a quarter inches long. It's really cute. 
It is wood. Put that aside. If you see anything or you know what you're looking for, you want to see it and we don't we haven't showed it, please put it in the chat and we'll, we'll do that for you. And you can also um, email us later if you're watching this on a review. Please leave the thumbs up. This is a Vera Bradley in excellent condition. I would even venture to say it was new. There's no marks in the inside at all. There's no marks here. This is $7 start. It's a little one with the mirror. The mirror still has the plastic on it. I want to make sure that, that it's not scratched. Yep. The mirror still has the plastic on it. It fits in this little pocket here, so you'll never lose your mirror. It is seven inches by five inches, and it is Vera Bradley. Oh, I didn't cute. That. Yeah, I thought this was a really cute one. It's a nice spring color. And I have this one, still has the tag on it. This is number six when I was doing it. This one, because it is number six, I will sell it for six dollars. It has the ID pocket there, brand new with the tags here. Great for reseller. It has this rose on this side. This is a little wristlet. It doesn't hold my phone, so I don't use this one. But then again, I only use my phone now. I've become one of those annoying people. And it's Beer Bradley as well. There's a tag inside. Oh, wow. This is RFDI, RFID protected. So you can put your stuff in here and it will not get scanned. It's not scannable. Which I had some guy try to scan me in the city when I was walking there. He's like, put this phone up against my purse. I said, ha ha, fooled you. You can't get mine. I got a hat. Four dollars, brand new with the tag. Lint, no extra charge. You're so kind. I know, right? It's the things I do for people. And if you would put this on, you would be incognito if you threw on some sunglasses. Then I have a choice. If I can get them, I've got. I forgot them, where I put them. I, I, you get a ruler. Which is done in centimeters or a wrench, and it's a pen, so it's your choice brand new pen or wrench, pen or uh, oh, excuse me, they're both pens wrench or pencil or ruler. <laughs> they're Those both are great for dads, and Father's Day is coming, Easter's coming. So, Especially if they they like to work with cars or wood or. This is so cute. They're two dollars each. Great for gift giving, throwing in a little bit of extra stocking. Great for using. I like different pens, so I I don't mind having different pens. I have lots of different pens. So. And let's see. My timer is over. And we're back to Becky. Bringing it back, baby. Bringing it back. <laughs> okay. I'm three for three, you guys. I remembered where I left off. Yay! <laughs> it would be a good day. I must have <laughs> eaten my Wheaties today or what. I don't even know. <laughs> okay. Letter O. $4. So, yeah, letter O. And then it's $4. It's not $40. <laughs> the book <laughs> is Dan Brown. It is the law symbol which I believe is the sequel or part of the Da Vinci Code. Uh, he is the author of the Da Vinci Code. And this is the hardcover book. And there it is. I just have it in this protective cover because otherwise I've been known <laughs> to um, ding a page. $4, letter O, Dan Brown, the lost symbol. Next, P. 
is three dollars. I tried to get a couple letters in while it wasn't my turn. It is this beautiful ring. Look how pretty. And what I love about this ring, first of all, it's adjustable. So it's just on elastic, so it can fit any size. But if you're like me and you have bigger fingers, it looks nice to have like a chunky um, piece. It actually makes your fingers look smaller when you have on chunky jewelry. So there's stones in here that are blue. Does that look blue or black on the camera? Lovita like says she wants both, but I'm not yeah, sure. I wasn't paying attention. But Lovita wants both. Is it Lovda or Lovita? Hi. Lovita. Good to meet you. You want both. Uh, both the book and the ring, just let us know. P, $3. And it is, I don't want to stretch it out, but it is elastic. Oh, you from Yarn Again. She wants both of the last, what was the last thing you had, Yarn Again? Good question. <laughs> Come on, Teresa. <laughs> you don't have it all memorized. <laughs> Like you said, there'll be a test at the end. <laughs> I fail tests. I panic. <laughs> this is why we resell, right? <laughs> yes. Yeah. No, there's very low, low pressure, low, low everything. Low expectations works for me. <laughs> <laughs> right. If you have high expectations when it's my turn, you have to go somewhere else. <laughs> Letter Q, $15. Oh, look how pretty this is twinkling in the light. Oh, my God. That is pretty. Yeah. Come more to the other side. To the middle. You're Thank you. Yeah, there I'm, you telling you, I'm like, it's reverse of what I want to do. I, it's, it's not, I, my brain is on backwards today. Levita, I think you're lagging, honey. Make sure you're in live chat. Refresh. Yeah, and you know what? Just say say the name of the item so that we can have clarity. So it is a lobster closure, and it's silver. It's um has a few different adjustable sizes, and then it's double strand. And look how pretty. The stones are are beveled so that they're catching the light. Oh my gosh. Gorgeous. $15 letter Q. Next. Next, next, next. Oh my gosh. I have so, I'm just was putting something on the floor and I realized I have so much to show you guys. Okay, Becky, talk faster. <laughs> it's Tooch still here. <laughs> letter R is five dollars i hear a man is someone's honey there behind my, the my son brought me some oh some, uh raisin bread oh hi honey pat pass I'm it some this kidding. way <laughs> this is letter r five dollars sorry i don't have any raisin bread for you look how pretty they're little angel wings with a Stone that's like a slightly light blue heart, and then uh, this says, "With brave wings she flies." And then there's another little heart with the stone. I'll show you the saying here. Isn't that pretty? That's a cool message. And then there's the last thing is this little bead here, and the brand is Footnotes. And it is adjustable. So this, I don't know if you could see me pushing it. It can kind of adjust to a few different sizes. I will say the lettering here is a little bit faded. Tooch said he's here lurking. And oh, shipping. here you are. He's lurking, lurking and working, lurking and shipping. I love it. Letter R, $5. I was just <laughs> teasing because I need to talk faster. <laughs> Get more done. <laughs> I, I actually don't think anyone would want to watch me if I started talking any faster. You'd be like, it's too much. Q, R, and then this is going to be S. Okay. Letter S is $2. It is a single stamp that says, wishing you a day filled with good things. It is a used stamp, and the brand is Hero Arts. $2, letter S, wishing you a day filled with good things. Tooch, I'm, I'm proud of you. I think getting work done with YouTube on in the background is like the best way to get, get things going. I'm like always listening to something, whether it's a book or a podcast or YouTube, of course. All my friends. Letter T for She wants the ruler yarn. 
Do you know which the, one that is? The pens. The I was muted answering you. Yes. Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, okay, you got it. And then I said, oh, you're down to 10 seconds. And I said it two minutes and I guess you didn't hear me. Sorry, Becky. Right. No, it's okay. I'm glad we figured it out. <laughs> and now I don't have enough hands. <laughs> Letter T, $4. It is a set of four stamps. They say happy spring. And there's a little bunny. And then two cute little eggs. Just in time for Easter card making. Send all your friends and family a homemade Easter card. Happy spring is kind of like in a double font. Cute little bunny. And an egg with a heart. And eggs with, with flowers. And that is letter T. Four dollars. And that was your last item this round. All right. Thank you. All Bye. right. I don't know if you guys ever heard of or remember. I don't know if there's, I don't think they're still in business. It's called Pink Zebra. And they sold uh, like, uh, what do you call them? Uh, wax. Wax. Oh, wax. Yeah. So they used to sell the. Yeah, they're the, still in business. Oh, okay. Anyway. The box says pecan pot, but it's not. It's a berry. It looks like berry jam. Yeah, it, it's berry. Oh, my God, y'all. If y'all could smell them. I wish we had smell them. Oh my God, they're wonderful. But due to my migraines, I can't use a lot of this stuff anymore. So I will do $5 for this. It's in a glass jar. It even says $1 for the jar return. So... Five dollars. It smells wonderful. I don't know how old it may be here a couple years, but because it's been sealed up on my shelf, because I had bought these, um, it smells like the day I bought it. So, guys, I'm going to show this. It's a little pricey, but I am selling it for a friend. She was going to put them in her antique booth, but before they go, I'm going to offer these to you. They are going to be $30. They are gorgeous. They're vintage. They're, I think, from the 70s. Mark and Mike had told me, Mike actually told me it was from the 70s. If you could see the, the painting, they're hand-painted. Very pretty. They're gorgeous. They're this big. So $30 for the set. If anybody's interested in these, if you're a collector of that type of thing. But I just thought I'd show them for her. This is for um, somebody, and it has a film on it, which is why it's uh, cloudy looking. Like the back has the film on it, so it makes it look cloudy. I don't know why the film is not on the front. But anyway, it says, I wish you happiness and success in the world. So somebody who retired left a job, left a group or any, you know, the world is your oyster guys, whatever. It does stand on its own. Um, you know, it would have to be on a steady piece of something. It's in the box. What did I say? $3. Okay. I wasn't sure. Sorry. Um, I have this tea towel, $3. It says, I'm not going to open it because it's sealed in the bag. It says, um, sentiment tea towel, dual purpose hand towel, tea towel. It's from the cook shop. And it says, meals and memories are made here. And this is the, the towel. It's double-sided design. So this, the back has... This design, and this is the front, $3. My Mother's Day is coming up. Um, $2. It's a, a little thin uh, canvas bag, and it says, Only the best moms get promoted to Yaya. Aww. The only reason I didn't keep it is because I'm a Mimi. Oh, that's cute. Mimi and Yaya. So um, this $3 also, it says, I'm not 30, I'm 21. With nine years experience. <laughs> That's cute. 
Oops, I almost dropped my drink. Well, I only have one of these now because Bella jumped up for the bread and broke one. Oh, no. So this little guy, girl, will be $5 in a purple dress. I'm, like, heartbroken because she broke it. It's like a little fairy. I don't think it's an angel. I think it's a fairy. Or she can be whatever you want her to be. She's got flowers in her hair. She is made out of resin, but she's absolutely gorgeous the other one was too yeah i'm so sad i can whip that dog but i won't because i love her and she's big and doesn't know that she's 75 pounds she thinks she's five this she train she's this is five. <laughs> huh? she thinks she's like precious nice and yes small. she thinks she's this size and yep. she's 75 pounds she's a standard poodle y'all yeah, six dollars for this ring I hardly wore it. I could count on one hand how many times I wore it. That's the back side. It does have one of those little thingamabobs in the middle. So it can be a seven because it has that little thing in the middle or an eight. I think those kind of pull out if you want it to, but it's really pretty. It is a little heavy. So that is that. And if you're a collector of carnival glass, I will do $7 for this. It's a quilted pattern. It has one tiny little scratch on the finish. I don't even know if you could see it. You might be able to see it this way. Where is it? Right here. If you could see the uh, scratch. Barely, barely, barely. Susie, woozy. My, my other partner in crime. Guys, make sure you sub to Susie Woozy because she and I are in the dog house. And I think this week we'll be in Susie's dog house. And that was your time. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, guys. Hello, I'm back causing trouble and havoc everywhere I go. All right. This item is $2. If you know somebody turning 21 or a drinker, you can, a wine connoisseur. If you're going to give a bottle of wine to the hostess, you can just bring this and put it on the bottle of wine. May this wine brighten the mind and the strength and the spirit. And you can put it right on the bottle of wine. They get a little keepsake with their wine. Because we all know they're not going to save. Well, they, some people decorate the wine bottles. This I thought was really cute. It's $2. And it is. It's plastic, I think. It's got a seam on the bottom. So I miss, I have to say it's plastic. They don't seem glass. It looks like it's got real wine in there. But it's not. That's cute. With the little grapes there. It's about three inches. It, I have this ribbon chiffon, brand new, in the box. In this, in the plastic, annoyingly loud wrapping. Three colors of blue, and it's got, that's the edge, and that's what it looks like. Kind of looks like gauze to me, but it's silk, so no. It's really cute, though. I'd put it on cards, no problem. Wrap a gift with it. Chiffon ribbon, $2.00. Then I have my last hammer pen left. This is $3. I don't get these at a good, good enough price to bring them back. And this is, has the cover on them. And it's the last one I have. $3 for the hammer. Just put hammer in the chat. If you want anything, if it doesn't have a name, just say, okay, I want the bottle of wine. I'll know what you're talking about because I can't sell wine. Oh, that does sound like Does sound like glass. Mm-hmm. It may be glass. Then I have this wood vintage elephant. I don't know what he is. He's just a wood vintage element elephant. He just sits there and looks cute. Four dollars. He is vintage. He's painted on eye. He's that thick. He's flat on the back. And there are no markings. There are no markings. 
I thought it was so cute. Four dollars. And if nobody else wants them, I'll take them. My mom collects. Oh, does she? Yeah, okay. my mom collects elephants. Okay, I'll put that to the side. You got it. You got it. Oh, and I have a cigar box. I think it's a cigar box. It says cocktail on it. So we were saying yesterday it's probably one of those brandy snifters or something. This is I don't I don't smell anything, but it's like that. This piece slides on. You could put legs. Oh, you got it undone. <laughs> I had my husband open it. This <laughs> I was like, I can't get it open, honey. So I leave it partially open. Now. Yes, Angela. So this, Thank you. This is oh, that's nice. I'll start that. So this is four dollars. Oh my gosh, I think I. My son said more, but see, I sell stuff for my son and my husband. Four dollars for that. I have a bag that my husband made with four dollars. He's got an introductory special going. It's I'll measure how big it is, and it's black on the inside. So if you don't want it to be this color, which I really like the Asian print. You put it black. And Dad, you're so talented. I know you're listening. Four dollars. Those would be great to bring on the cruise. They would be, right? <laughs> when you know you how many of these I could stuff in a... Right. You need to make Teresa some uh, Caribbean looking ones for the cruise. <laughs> <laughs> I think he'll take me. He's going to get me soon. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have to book one ourselves you know dawn we are 20 yeah, we're gonna book a reseller cruise yeah we should we should get together and do that 2026 i'm totally yeah. in for a reseller cruise all right see 19 <laughs> by 16 and a little bit <laughs> thank you and shut up <laughs> i love that man <laughs> These are machine washable. They do fit in a gentleman's back pocket, my tote bag, anywhere you go. And Lovita, just to, real quick, you wanted one of these. I have more and I have these. Did you want any of the wrenches, Lovita, or anyone else? These are $2 each. I have more than one of each. Of well, them. I think she said she was going to take both when she had put in that, there. Yeah, and that's why I'm asking. Yeah. I know she wants the ruler. But I have the wrench as well, Lovita. And if you want the wrench as well, just let me know. And I do have more than one of both of them. Okay. Let me see how much time I have. 19 seconds. That'll be that for that. All right. To, uh, Toot, you're Thank looking you. at us. Me, Teresa, and you. That's it. We're the board of directors. And we'll start signing people up. 2026. <laughs> there we go. I love it. The board of directors. So, so. Do you have to have some kind of qualifying characteristics to be in? No, none. Fun. You qualify, <laughs> girl. Person, you can do All right. We should see if your son can be like the the boat captain or something. <laughs> oh, girl. He already <laughs> said when we go on the cruise that he's going up to the, to the uh, what do you call it? Oh, the, like the water master? Like the, the yeah, board? you know, the... <laughs> Oh, I can't think of it. Cruise liner? Har Harbor master? Dad. <laughs> yes, we want you there. Because I yes, know my husband. want you there. Cool. Somebody's got a car. I'm overqualified. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you can be our, our honorary cruise director. <laughs> oh, somebody told me, where was it? I don't remember where I was. They said that I should be like the entertainment on like a cruise like like the <laughs> entertainment director or whatever like you know welcome to yes, your cruise, cruise director you would be great oh bella came to say hi guys <laughs> hi bella hi bella everybody oh. let me let me put her up real quick yeah look at bella look at how big oh. that dog is <laughs> ears the fluffy ears i'm gonna forgive you for breaking my angel oh, oh. She's sitting on you as if she's like a little teeny tiny lap dog. She does. Yeah, she does. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right. Back oh, to Becky. We gotta, we gotta give uh Becky an extra minute. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm restarting her time. 
Are we ready, Becky? Uh, no, we're not ready because you know why? I don't remember what letter we left off. <laughs> I'm like, crumb buckets. I think it was T. Hi, Mike and Mark or Mark. <laughs> hey, Mark, Mike. I think it's probably Mark. Yeah, it's probably Mark. Welcome in. Thank you for coming. And my just goodness, thank you for calling me a kid. <laughs> I like that. All me right, too. so Mark. We are planning a reseller cruise. Are you in? It's cool kids only. 2026. Oh, 2026. All right. You have plenty of time to plan and save your money. Yes. There you I go. I like 2025 better, to be honest. But well, yeah. Why not? Why not 2025? We'll take a vote. Okay. All right. How about tomorrow? I need to get away. <laughs> Yes, All right, it is Mark. <laughs> it is hi, Mark, and not Michael. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're on you. Better, I figured out what letter I was on. I believe it's you. Uh, it's one dollar. This is a set. I'm going to show you. Every once in a while, you guys know I have extra supplies. Supplies. I was. Um, I'm trying something new with my inventory, and so it has caused me to need different size bags. And then I bought the bags and then I decided to go back to what I was doing. So now I have lots of bags that I'm not using. <laughs> so here you go. Um, it is a set of assorted size bags, which is perfect if you're just getting started reselling or if you have a little, little things to package up. Five of these large ones, which I believe are the 10 by eight, five of these that are six by 10 and they're all clear cello bags. And then 10 of these little guys and the nice thing about the little guys is that they are the adhesive ones. The other ones are not. And the whole set is $1. Letter U. I have an abundance. So let me know if you want quantities or if more than anyone, if more than one person wants them, I can accommodate. Um, like I said, tried some different things and now I'm changing it up yet again. So um, my goof up is your gain. $1. Letter U. Again, it's five of the bigs five of the mediums and then 10 of the small with the adhesive so there we have it let me put these over here because they slip slide all over the place next up is letter v i wish johnny was here because this little guy reminds me of him <laughs> it's a lobster <laughs> five dollars <laughs> <laughs> so i don't know my c crustaceans is this it's not a crab right it's a lobster right it's yeah. a lobster okay he's he, he's too long to be anything else but i don't know his face said crab to me five dollars letter v it's funny johnny was talking about changing his um his logos and stuff away from the crocodile and <laughs> we were saying what what should it be so here's a lobster letter v five dollars and it has the tag still on it and it's in perfect condition but i did get it from a consigner so i say new but it might have been sitting on someone's shelf but again it's not there's not dust or anything on it it's in perfect condition that i can tell all right go back to your little home little little friends <laughs> go back inside your bag you water okay yeah, I know. <laughs> there was, do you ever get those stupid ads on, um, like when you're like reading an article, these ads come up, there was some ad and it was like these two little fish and they were out of the water and they, they were like so thirsty. They were like, we need water. It was like for, for a game or something. And I was like, I don't know why this is breaking my heart. Just looking at these guys. <laughs> I was like, stop showing me this. I feel bad. And it's not even something I'm like doing. I don't know. Um, it's yeah. My, my mind what, what is that ad from like the 80s and 90s? Like your mind is a terrible thing to play to waste. My mind is a, is a terrible wasteland. of yourself. $4 letter W. It's a little candle holder and it reminds me of springtime. Just these little beads and um, it's metal and the little leaves. Just something cute for like a spring mantle decoration, home decor. $4 letter W and I can measure it up if you're interested. Instead of the love boat, we could call it the soul boat. Oh, I love that. <laughs> soul boat. <laughs> oh, 
Do you guys know that I teach um, aqua like exercise? So if there's a pool on board, I will do some aqua dancing for you if you want. All right. <laughs> We're gonna hold you to it. Yeah. There so now are. this cruise has to happen, you guys. That, that's how that works. All right. I have a bin of one dollar items. They are mostly um, scrapbook and like stamping embellishments. So I'm going to give them each a different keyword and you guys can um, just call, ooh, call it based on keyword. And I just dropped a bunch of grommets on my legs. Okay. <laughs> First up, uh, keyword will be frame. It is an assorted bag of little embellishment metal frames. First one is rectangular and the next one is oval. And there are three of each in this set. So frame is the keyword. And I'll see if I can hold them all. Here they are. Oops. All in a set. And I got one more here. Getting it. And the keyword is frame. And they're at little embellishments, oval and rectangular. Next, also $1, is pewter stickers. The brand is magenta. And if you can see the color, they are in fact like a pewter silver and they are stickers. Let's see if I take them out. I don't want One them minute. And they're hearts and there's the adhesive back. It's a set of two. Keyword is heart. Here's another one that is keyword circle. It's also a set of two. I'm not going to take these out and they are fine pewter. They're large circles. Actually, there might be three in here. Nope, just two. Sticker adhesive back, keyword circle. Keyword buttons, bag of buttons, large, small, different colors, different sizes. Thanks, Janice. And there's a funky red one in here. That's a bonus button. But all the other <laughs> ones are like in earth tones, keyword buttons. Keyword birthday is a bag of happy birthday. There's presents. There's the words happy birthday. And they're confetti, all metallic, multicolor. And another set of pewter peel and sticks. I need you to hand me my stuff. Dream is the keyword. And that's your time. All right. She made her way Thank you so much, Janice. Donna, are you? Who goes next? Juan, you go next, right? Yeah. There you go. <laughs> she made her way all the way up, y'all. So your cup run is over. Oh, oh, oh okay. no. No, right here. I'm going to start bidding on Bella. <laughs> Bella and Precious are not for sale. So Sean's going to hand me the stuff. Okay. So I have my little Christmas mystery bags. Well, they're not real mystery because. They have a you know a little window five dollars each and this one has like a noah's ark so this one looks smaller but there are smaller ornaments and I'm stuff pausing, in it. i'm pausing your time for a second uh becky you have a you got it, a plastic bag sure thing i was just about to um put it in the chat just let me know how many just one or if you need multiples thanks Janice. okay go gone okay, okay. Here's the next one, $5, number two. This one's got like vintage, oops, brushes is falling. Uh, it's got vintage cookie cutters, a Santa on like snow skis, a Russ Bell, all that good stuff. I don't know where Bell thinks she's going, y'all. This one has um, some little porcelain vintage ornaments. All five dollars. Oh, that one's number three. It's number one. Here's number one. It's got two little Dalmatians, some vintage. The bags uh, are five. Oh, five dollars for the bags. Yeah. Janice is talking to Becky. Okay. Oh, okay. And it's got a pewter, vintage pewter ornament in there. Here's number four. Shauna, Sean is my Vanna. This one's got like a little morning, corn husk. Huh? Say good morning, Sean. Good morning. This is number four. It has a, a little plastic saints uh, one. It's got some Santa salt and pepper shakers, a corn husk doll, this little corn upside down thing. This one is number four. 
Is this an eight? Oh, no. This is number eight. It, it also has a little saints uh, ornament. It's got a carousel horse, a Santa um, ceramic. It's got a cookie cutter in the back. That's not vintage. This is number 10. This is number 10. It is $5. It is chock full of earrings. Great for resellers. I'm going to take precious. So um, this one is also $5. It's all wearable, sellable jewelry. Uh, it's all earrings. This, one this is number eight. And I did that one with number eight. I'm sorry. This is just put lamb. Wait, Sean, I can't open it. Oh. One handed. Uh, she's got to go in a minute. <laughs> I oh think it's 75 pounds on my lap. That's heavy. So these are these little baby lambs. They are about an inch or so tall so cute. and it comes with a little card that says it says prayer card and it says lord help me to pray it'd be great for like a little sunday um sunday school janice wants two bag sets um thank, thank you, you. I got started. it perfect thanks thanks janice oh, bella where are you going oh. And then this is some little wooden alphabet beads. One dollar for the whole bag. That's cool. So, and that's all I got right now. <laughs> <laughs> and a heavy Bella. <laughs> and a heavy Bella. She's going somewhere. I don't know where. <laughs> all right. I'll take my turn. Let all right. Change that sign right there. And I'll start my timer. You had two minutes left. Oh, you all right? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'm, probably, I'm gonna have a fat lip. Oh no! It's my odd. dog broke my bone right here one year. Oh. He ran into me. Right? Hi, Tammy. Yeah, right she there. had at me just Red. now, trying to get off. Tammy's in for the beads, Don. Okay. Thank you, Tammy. Thank you, Tammy. I started for you. I don't know if y'all. Um, all right. I have these guys. I, I've got to do them. I think my husband said $4. But if Tooch is still here, he'll let me know if I'm too low or too high. I have what I think is an older ornament for Batman and Robin. I have choices of these. So just put Batman. Oh, wait. There's more than one Batman. Put Robin. These are four dollars each. I hope that's what he said. If he didn't, write it in the chat, and I'll stop selling them. And we got this guy here. He's one of the turtles. I like turtles, but not this kind. It opens back here somehow. Here, there we go. It opens at the back. Four dollars. I got Superman. Christmas. He said three. You said three. All right, y'all. We got a discount. Three dollars <laughs> for Superman. Thanks, Dad. Three dollars for the Ninja Turtle. Three dollars for the Batman and Robin. This Batman looks like he's got a hex nut missing in his back. Three dollars for the Batman. This looks like a newer Batman. See the face? I like the older Batman. I like the one with that other guy. What was his name? The one that came out in 98 because my... Or 90s because my son was little and he got the first Batman. Is that Val Kilmer? No, the one before that one. No. Oh, I, I have his face in my... I can't think of his name. I know, me too. Yeah. This little car is three dollars. Hope he said that for the cars too. Little car. Oh yeah. By the way, I charge you a hundred percent, Dad. Okay, you can watch it on the rerun and just email one of us. Our emails are floating around in the chat, or I mean, in the description. The wheels work on these. And 
that's all the cars. So the two cars are three dollars each, or five for both. And this is the last Batman I have. Angela wants Michael Keaton. Oh, or maybe she's Michael telling Keaton. me. Michael. That's the one. Right. That's the one I like the best. And that is another Batman for three dollars. So we have four different Batman to choose from. So this is going to be a doozy how to figure this out. Okay, this one you put with Robin if you want that one for $3. Crouching Tiger, you could put Crouching for this one. This one, Batman. This one, Cape. That way, if you want them, let's see, three, six, nine. That's $12 here. I'll sell all four for $10. Anyone interested? All four Batman, $10. And I'll give him his money. I won't keep it all. <laughs> keep a percent. I will. $10, all four Batman. Man, how do you do that? It's Batman, but there's more than one of the same person. All right. $3. Little purse. Little Asian per influence per really cute. You could throw a lipstick in there, your Apple, your credit card, or whatever. It is embroidered. It has the texture of embroidered. Oh no, it doesn't. It's soft. It's soft. It's not embroidered. It is woven into the material, which appears to be silk. There's no name on it. It's got the kiss hinge. And it's got the red interior, $3, number 45, $3. Let's see, what else does he have in here? I have Obago buttons. These are vintage buttons. These are $4. Oh, that one's really pretty. <laughs> I like buttons. Oh, no, it's not. It's cloth. I thought it was a flower. My eyes are going. We got these. We got these. These you can cover. Well, there's that one. This is a thought of flower, but it's not. It's a bunch of cloth. Imagine. Oh, look at the polka dots. And look, you can make these into earrings. Those are so pretty. Let's see how much time I have that left. 27 seconds, guys. All right. Here's the button. That's really, this is a vintage button as well. That's really, really pretty. And then we have this one. And if Becky is ready, I've got 12 seconds. Oh, look, this leather at one. Oh, look, it's got the crown on there. I don't know if that means anything. I am not a button person. I like them. Yeah, it's got somebody's crest on it. I thought you said somebody's crust. Yeah, <laughs> like, crust. You know, you said crust, like on like a like schmutz. No, <laughs> it's. I should have said their coat of arms. It just struck me as funny. I was like, oh, she's like saying it with. She's proud of that. <laughs> so someone's crust on it. No, nah. <laughs> that was on the button. Oh dear. All right, I wrote down where I left off, so I'm on top of things. Letter W, one dollar. It is a bag, keeping with the embellishments of clothespins. Uh, they are all different. They're covered with. It's not washi tape. I'm not sure exactly what it is. It must be a sticker from the manufacturer, but they have all different um, patterns on them. Little pink flowers, polka dots. This one's black and white chevron and. Down here is more cute little flowers. It's a package of five. Letter W, one dollar. Next. Five dollars is a Easter stamp. X is the letter. And it is Easter eggs on a roll. And it doesn't say the brand. Look how cute. So they're just rolling eggs. They're having their own little party. <laughs> Letter X, $5. Next is also $5. Oh, no, I lost my sticker. Hold, please. 
uh, letter X. This is letter Y. Hang on. Lost my sticker. And it's also $5. And it's also a Easter stamp. There we go. It is a large egg. Oh, and that's pretty, though. That pretty. is pretty. Yeah. With the little flowers on it. Selling this for one of my consigners. A lot of my consignment um, clients are into crafting. And this is Stampin' Up! from 1998. So you can't get it any longer. Discontinued. And that's letter Y. Next is letter Z. I'm going to write it in here small. And then we're going to go to double letters, you guys. <laughs> also, letter Z. This is hydrating socks with shea butter, jojoba oil, and vitamin E. Softens dry and rough feet. Intensive moisturizing from heel to toe. One size fits most, up to women's size 11. And there's a skirt tab at the ankle to keep it on. And it is one pair. Letter Z, $5. Is this right? There we go. Okay. <laughs> and just to tell you a little bit more, you take the mask out of the pouch. You put your foot into the mask. Thank you. Peel off the sticker to hold it in place. Leave it on for 20 minutes and then remove and discard massage remaining cream into the skin. There's no need to rinse. Oh my gosh, this is actually making me feel like I just want to keep it and do this now. <laughs> Doesn't the thought of like having like nice hydrated feet for springtime just seem like super refreshing? Letter Z, $5. I'm putting this to the side because I'm going to keep it if nobody wants it. <laughs> Sounds like a good deal. Get Spot day for me. <laughs> <that crew. laughs> In 2026. <laughs> oh, we might change it to 2025. I got to see what kind of deals I'm going to get. I'm going to seriously look. Awesome. I, yeah, I just got back from um, Mexico a couple months ago, and it was so affordable. I was I was really oh. impressed. All right, I'm going to show you what this is, and then I'm going to take it apart and show you for real. Double letter A, double A, six dollars. It is puzzle sticks. This is so cool. The brand is Mud Puppy. So it comes in this little case. And this is for one of my consigners. She's a local um, Delaware resident. So it's a little board. It's a puzzle board. But look how cool. This isn't like any traditional puzzle. You get these little sticks that are in here. And there are several different puzzles. There are six in total. And then you line... I'll see if I can show you. You line the puzzle sticks up on the board to create the puzzle. So obviously I didn't pick the right ones because I'm just doing it like this, but how unique and creative. This is a cute item for an Easter basket or just something different. And each has a front and back. And then when you stack them up in the right order, of course, not like I just did, you create a picture that's the puzzle. And so it's a set of six unicorn themed uh, puzzles and it is six dollars double a and here's the back of the box so you can see the different you know this is what i was kind of talking about how you put them together and there's a hot air balloon castle unicorn flutter by and another unicorn sitting on its side oh you can see the original price so for six dollars you got a bargain <laughs> letter a a that can keep a kid busy for hours Oh my gosh. And like the fact that you can take them out and switch them. I actually had my daughter do the puzzle. Now she's 11, but I just wanted to make sure that I had all the pieces because, you know, you don't want to be selling something without all the pieces. And it actually did occupy her for a while. I was like, oh, okay. Like it's not old for even a, a teenager. Okay. Letter double B. We're into the double letters, y'all. This is impressive. Another Easter stamp, $5, BB, and it is Happy Spring. She's so cute, little chick holding a little sign in her egg, and then she's next to two more eggs. Now, this is the brand Great Impressions, and it appears to be unused. I can't tell for sure, but I don't see even any residue on that. Letter BB, $5. And again, it's for one of my consigners, so I'm just not exactly sure. <laughs> one dollar, springtime. Oop, I'm knocking something over over here. CC is the letter. It is a set of three spring hair clips. 
for a darling little girl. This is for the fundraiser that I do. They collect items from um, their participants and then their profits goes to a foster care program in Maryland. So it's $1 set of three pink, purple, and blue letter CC. And I'll show you the closure on the back is, um, I don't know what you call this kind of closure, but it's one of the ones that's just easy to set right in your hair. And it's a set of three letter CC, $1. And okay, we're really gonna struggle. <laughs> I'm gonna struggle showing you this here. Um, how much time do I have, Teresa? You are, that's your last item. You just ran okay. out of time. All right, I'll do my best to show it and show it quickly. Uh, DD, $2. Wait, that last one was my last one or this is my that's last fine. one? That's fine, no, finish this one. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. I didn't, I didn't hope I didn't misunderstand you. That's so I have a set of these little um, crafting beads and they are glass beads. Why am I having so much trouble getting things focused on the camera today? They, Put your hand in front of your eyes because it tries there. to focus on your eyes. Uh, hang on, hang on. I don't want to drop them. Because it's trying to focus on my eyes. Oh, that's good to know. Okay. Is it blurry? It's better. Hold on. Let's get really close and then try to focus it. How about that? Good? No. We can make it out. Yeah. So it's just like like a few different colors in there. It's greens and blues. It's round. And there's a set of one, two, three, four. There's another one back here. And then five. Sorry, I lied. All different shapes. And then some smaller green glass beads. Two dollars, letter, double D. And it's a set of assorted beads. You get total one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine beads total. DD, $2. And that's it. That's my time. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Okay. I have these little $1 tic-tac-toe, and they come in, they're like an envelope, and they have these little felt markers that fit inside. These are great for the car, for, you know, little ones that'll drop things. So all the pieces tuck in here. There's, I think it's four of each, each one. So I have green, red, and yellow. So $1, I have uh, three red and two each of the, I mean three green and two each of the red and yellow. These cute for Easter baskets, just a little, you know, visiting grandma, Pop them one, you know, keep them busy. And uh, that's that. Um, I don't know if anybody does like sublimation or DTF. And if you do the tumblers, this is the new thing everybody's using to hold the paper around your tumbler as an extra set of hands. I have a set of two. I'll do three dollars on these. This bag is kind of funky, so um a set of two so you would put it on your tumbler to hold the wrap on it while you tape it so three dollars for the set of two that's a good um, idea yeah those are they come in handy because it's like you're trying to you know i put them right. up, put it on my lap try to hold it tight get the tape on it's crazy so i have some uh bisque blue bisque it's not jasper wear but it is blue Bisque. This one does need to be cleaned, but I didn't want to fool with it. This one is made in Japan, and I'll do that one, and let's see, this one together for $2. This one's a little darker. This one also says Japan on the back. You can see it a little bit. It's not focusing. And I would think a uh, like a magic eraser or something. I don't think would hurt it. I have this little um, trinket box. It says Ornell's. So this may be a hobbyist handmade piece. And it has a rose. Ornell's. Uh, people collect different ceramics from these brands. So $2. Um, 
I have a few more pieces. This one, two dollars. It's an egg. It's hollow. This one is really pretty. Those are very nice. Um, and then I'll do this set of, let's see, no one went with that. These two little guys. I'll do a dollar on these. These are really cute. They're both alike. They're tiny. And um, this one, they're both from Japan. Okay. Um, oops. I have these uh, silicone molds. I have two of them. I'll do the set for four dollars. These are sucker, for, like suckers. It has the spot for the thing, um, the thing, the stick. So there's like a Mickey figure. Eggs, bunnies. So there's a spot for eight of them. And then this one has swirls and um, butterflies, flowers. So you could really put, like, if you make sucker suckers, like the sugar suckers or chocolate would be great for these. Two minute warning. I'm sorry. Two minute warning. Okay. And then these are the cooling towels. There are, I think there's two in here, where you wet them, put them behind your neck if you're working out in the sun. This one is gray. The other one is a light gray. One's a charcoal gray. One's a light gray. And they're mo modern technology, weaving technique. So ultra cooling, sweat absorbent, UV blocking. These. I have two of these, three bucks a piece. Um... And I'm running out of stuff anyway that I, because I didn't pull anything. This piano baby, $8. She's porcelain. She's this big. And uh, I just think she's lovely. She's a, uh, look at that face. I know, right? Or he. I don't know if it's yeah. a he or a she. It does have a little ribbon on its back. This is the bottom. It is unmarked. And if there's no interest, it's going to take a ride to my booth today. And then these are purple. Um, these are going to be $3 a pack. They're purple um, awareness ribbon, the little silicone bracelets. Um, they're all different. Purple is for Alzheimer's, pancreatic cancer, um, dog abuse, which I didn't know, um, or animal abuse, uh, domestic violence, and more. You can look them up. But if you know somebody with any of those afflictions. So there's like one, two, three, four, five. I think it's like 20-something bracelets in each pack for $3. I have three. Ooh. Those are good to put in as thank yous to, to our buyers, too. Yeah, right. You know? I mean, I'm sure somebody has somebody with an affliction of those things. Um, these little trinket dishes, two dollars. It's upside, upside down. down. <laughs> <laughs> and that's your time. All right. It says this one says be free. This one says live in the moment. That I think it's about four inches. Um, made by Korma. They were like eight fifty a piece. Yeah, those things are expensive. Yeah. How much are you selling them for? Two dollars. A piece or a and, uh, Yeah, so I have three and I have five of these. Great for, you know, putting them next to the sink on your dresser. Ooh, Thomas is up. That means I get coffee. And uh, so... You could put yeah. a cookie and have a tea or a coffee. Yes, you could have a little tea or, you know, like I said, your rings or yeah. just anything, really. If you want to eat a piece of cake by yourself, I don't know. I would want a bigger piece, but just no, saying. No, They'd be a good, um, a good spoon rest, like, while you're cooking. I always have, yeah, like, that would work. Water. I leave it out well, all the time. I don't know. I cook so much at one time for my family that that would not work for me. But it could work <laughs> if you, you live alone and eat alone. <laughs> I use huge pots. Anyway, that's all I have right now, guys. Thank y'all so much. All right, we'll bring us all up.
There we go. Thank you, everybody, for coming today and joining us on Monday Mornings with Dawn and Teresa. And Becky, our special guest today, it was so much fun. Thank you for coming. Let us know where you're going to be and what's going on. I'll make you big. Thank you. Yeah, thanks for having me. So um, I am trying to do around one live sale a week. So um, I'll announce the next one on my channel in a couple of days. I'll, I'll put the... Um, the tag there, but I will probably be live on my channel at some point this week. I kind of stop in and come on just to chat and say hi, usually while I'm getting some work done. And usually if I've been a good girl, that means I've gotten my morning work done, my morning photos, my listings up and all that stuff so that I can then enjoy some time and get to see you guys and say hi and, and, just kind of chat while I'm getting things listed in my tracking spreadsheet. So thank you for hanging out with me today. This was so fun. I, I love, we always have a good couple laughs and, and a good time. So I love being here and I love being part of your fun and festivities and congrats on the new Monday show. This is really cool. This is exciting. Thank you so much. We're having fun. Yeah. So, trying to make it a little bit relaxed. Amen. <laughs> Don, where are you going to be? You want me All to make right. me big? You don't have to make me big. Okay. I'm good. Okay. So um, today's Monday. So Susie Woozy and I will be in the doghouse on Thursday, uh, 9.30 Eastern, 8.30 Central. Um, we'll be in Susie Woozy's doghouse. I think she had made a comment earlier. Um, make sure you sub to Susie Woozy in addition. And uh, Friday, it'll be Dawn Steals with yarn again Teresa, and as she's my new co-host so is so much fun it is fun and uh anybody else who needs a sub just holler at me um if anybody bought from me today and would like me to hold your box till friday just let me know or if i send you an invoice just send me a note in the email whatever that you want to wait until and i'll just build your box but um, it'd be great if I could know before I pack it. Um, if you need more time, let me know. Just don't ghost me. I appreciate it. Yeah, and I don't like ghosts. Yeah. Just say, hey, sure, Angel, I can hold yours. Yeah. Um, that way, if you want to combine shipping on stuff, it'd be great. And um, like I said, shoot me an email if you have any problems or want me to hold it to the next auction. Because I'm on uh, twice a week, Monday and Fridays. So I can, you know, very likely do that for you. Not a problem. Yeah. And that's it for me. I have a box for you as well, Angela. I'll hold it for you. Just let me know when you're ready for it. And um, I'm on Wednesday with the East Coast resellers at 1030, my channel. And then Friday, I'm on with Dawn on Dawn, hey. Dawn's Deals. I have to remember to change the name <laughs> on Dawn's Deals on Dawn's channel. And I appreciate everybody coming out and have a blessed day and stay safe. Bye guys. Bye.